Um, I'm very distressed that the paint companies uh, brought forward the idea that there's individual jeopardy for homeowners. No one up here believes that. I can only think you're talking to the public to promote your um, initiative. The other thing I would like to bring up is the idea that Mr. Anderson brought up that somehow there would be additional um, responsibilities, lack of insurance for homeowners. Um, this has been stated by the proponents of this initiative before. According to the California Association of Realtors, this is not the case. Said June Barlow, the organization's general counsel. She said the state already requires disclosure of lead paint during home sales, so the risk has been reflected in property values for years. Barlow also said in a closing statement of November's court decision uh, that lead paint in general is being labeled a public nuisance, not the presence of lead paint in individual homes. It's deceptively called the Healthy Homes and Schools Act. It's a taxpayer ripoff, rip said the LA Times. Look, it will be paid for the taxpayers, but we're not increasing the uh, amount of tax that the taxpayers are paying. Most people don't realize what bonds are, but basically they're a call on the general fund. And as I said earlier, this money is going to come away from money that might be used for homeless, that might be used for uh, medical care. Um, that's where this money will come from if this bond measure is passed. Um, the other thing is, I can only think that the last statement, uh, the state, the um, statement of uh, President Obama is taken terribly out of context. What he, what I believe he was talking about is that we shouldn't identify kids who happen to live in a particular town as bad kids or handicapped kids. However, the kids who are poisoned by lead, you can't reverse that. Um, the most you can do if a kid really has a very high lead level, and in very few cases this is done, you can do chelating, which removes lead from the system, but that's, that's rarely done. The damage is done already, um, and we know what it does. And in fact, one of the theories of why crime suddenly went down in the 90s is because in 1978, we stopped using lead gasoline, lead paint, et cetera. Um, so I just want to say that I've never heard such deceptive tem uh, testimony in my life. And uh, it takes a lot to get me angry. You have gotten me angry. Thank you.